What's going on YouTube? In today's video, I'm gonna show how you can make your own options active trading layout in your Weeble paper trading account. Let's roll. Okay, so you just set up your Weeble account and uh, you don't really know what to do, so I'm gonna help you with that. So whenever you download your Weeble desktop application, you're actually gonna wanna go over here to the sidebar, right click, click all layouts, and then make sure this paper trading tab right here has the star checked. Come over here to paper trading and you're going to be prompted with this screen here you could use some of these already pre-made charts but we're going to make something that looks just like this which i made earlier so we'll go click over here blank paper chart and this should be a very quick video we're going to kind of blow through this so first off you want to do your chart and then this is basically where you can see all of your charts kind of throw it up here in this corner because you won't really need it that much for now uh want to click on options twice this will be able to have your calls and your puts for the same stock that you're looking at. Uh, we can kind of, you know, just fit these in here how you want it. Let's go over here, set this as group one and set this as group two. You'll see what I mean here in a second. So we'll go over here to our paper. We'll go over here to click uh, active trader. Click that twice. Drag one up here. Drag one down here to where it's even. Size these up accordingly over here do it to where these are kind of stacked on top of each other just kind of even them out that'll give you more room over here to make your chart bigger obviously so like I said set this to group one set this to group two so that these two are paired before you do anything go ahead and turn the top portion here into calls and then turn this bottom portion here into puts so now you have all of your call options over here you have your out of the money contracts and your in the money contracts and then you can also change how uh, many strike prices you want to go up and then same down here you have all your puts so you have your out the money puts and in the money puts so on this setting you're going to want to go to the settings active trade settings let this pop up uncheck whatever is listed under here in the stocks make sure there's nothing checked and you're going to want to have these two things checked right here the buy ask and the sell market and then you're also going to have your quantity and your close uh, checked as well so under the buy ask you want to make sure it's at the limit obviously because it's an ask and then you want your contracts to be one by default because you don't want to end up buying 100 contracts so sell market can also be market and your contract at one and then these two things you don't have to worry about so we'll go ahead and press done and then as you can see this is what it should look like you can do this and these two will line up so whenever this thing is finished if i go up three here or up four here this will go ahead and change to four as well but because we haven't published this yet, there's no need to. So I wanna go ahead and kinda of just show you guys what this does. So if I come over here and say, SPY is at this 399.40 area and I'm looking to go long into calls, I'd come over here, I would say, okay, I wanna get a 400 strike uh, contract at $69 a contract. So I'd go over here, click this, and they automatically show up. So you can see you got your 14th of December, contracts you have your $400 calls and then right here you can buy the ask which the ask is 0.69 which is $69 and then you can also sell at market once you're in this position and then same for down here since these two are linked you can go hey spy's not doing too good I'm going to go ahead and get into some short puts here so you click that and you now have your active trader to work the exact same way you could click here buy the ask and then it will also ping up so let's move on to the other thing so we're gonna go to paper sorry we're going to click positions come down here reposition it there and then your orders you want to grab the orders drag it into here if it'll let me just like that so you have your orders and your positions stacked up here together um, and then you can come right here put your paper account details so that kind of gives you a list of everything there and then at that point you don't need anything else on this chart uh, I do prefer to have my details kind of like this it gives me more of a wider look set this up to group one and then these do not have to be grouped but like right here you can come over here say you want to look at tesla you can put your tesla charts it shows everything you need you can put your indicators that you want as well so it's pretty dang pretty dang sweet so say if i wanted to go these 400 calls i'd click here go buy ask and then if we go to our orders you can see that it's down there waiting to get filled at whatever price we want it to be at if your order doesn't get filled you can come here right click cancel order modify create new order or view the order uh, information so there you go 
and then if you have a position working you can see all of your you know your PL, your percentages your daily profit everything right here just as you would in a regular account and as you can see if i go over here to my customize this is exactly how i trade on my real account i do all of my execution right here for my options trading but i chart everything through the thinkorswim platform and uh, yeah just personal preference but this this layout here is solid gold so i definitely recommend you guys to look at it uh definitely give it a chance set it up this way like i said this gives you kind of enough room to kind of just have a glance at how a stock's moving and yeah so if you ever wanted to change the contracts for something just look up tesla and then it brings you all the tesla call contracts and everything like that so say when you go to netflix puts if i can spell right Netflix puts, it brings all your puts up, and then as you can see, you can scroll down, go to the different days to expiration contracts, and there you go. And yeah, that's pretty much it. Hope you guys uh, found this uh, video useful. If you did, make sure to like. Uh, also, make sure to check the description. Our website and our Discord just dropped amazing prices. Definitely check it out. You can join the Discord for free and just kind of get a feel of it. And then if you want to get in on the free callouts, free signals, live voice, everything like that, all the education... Make sure to check out our website for all of our subscription prices. Definitely think you can take a lot of take a lot away from us and our admins and everybody else in the group, and it's definitely worth the money, obviously. So, uh, yep, that's all I got for today. Hope you guys like this video. If you want more things like this, kind of setup wise, uh, how the program works, I've kind of got really good with Weeble lately. So, just kind of comment down below what you want to see. Uh, thank you guys for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Peace.